Thank you. Now, after a cool weekend, you can work up a sweat starting tomorrow morning in Fitchburg when Gold's Gym opens its doors. News 3's David Douglas explains what the big new business means for the city. David? Andy, we hear about businesses closing every day. Here's one that's opening, and it's just the first of several more locations, all six-figure investments a Gold's franchise group hopes to make in the Madison area. A rocking cardio routine at Fitchburg's new Gold's Gym does more than just get your blood flowing. It's helping get tax cash flowing through Fitchburg City coffers. I think the economy works well for us. Okay, we're not a high price club, but we offer a ton. Inside his new $6 million fitness facility, that's in some ways more country club than health club. This area is actually dedicated to core and abdominal. Owner Eddie Dale thinks his business is just the kind that can thrive in an out of shape economy. There's not a lot of things in a bad economy that you or somebody else can do every day of the month for 30 or 32 or 34 dollars a month. We caught up with Fitchburg Mayor Jay Allen at the Dane County Fair taking in the bear show. It is slower now. I mean, we can tell building permits are down this year. He says in a bear market, the new gym helps pump up the tax base and is working to find ways to make the weight of economic development a little easier to lift. And we're working through our zoning code right now to try to create a, a better process for approvals, something that's a little more efficient, gets people in and out of the system without a lot of bureaucracy. Our pool and spa area. Dale says Fitchburg was the ideal spot to open the first of what he hopes will be five Gold's gyms in the area, and that no one should sweat that his success will close doors at other clubs. Now, I've gone into other markets where people have failed, but they just quite frankly weren't that good. A sign that these times, and all of us, may be healthier than we thought. Other businesses in the area say Gold's will be great for them. With 2,000 members already signed up, regular traffic is sure to help. Alan, by the way, also wants to see future shopping developments have more mixed-use space clustered more closely to foster foot traffic and public transit. All right, we wish them and all the new business the very best. David, right. thank you very much.